<clears throat> well, hello there, teachers and students. My name is Wade Hood from Canadian High School. And as you can see from my shirt, I'm filming this on October 23rd. So it's National Mole Day because of Avogadro's number 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd. And actually, we celebrate Mole Day a lot in Canadian High School. We've learned about the mole when we learned about the atom and counting atoms and the average atomic mass. So we've been, some schools teach October 23rd. We taught, we taught a little bit earlier in my AP chemistry students have been celebrating it all year long. It's a party in my class. Today I wanted to show you about our lab aprons. Some people have had trouble with their lab aprons, especially tying them. So I cannot take credit for this, but I'm gonna video this, but I'm gonna give credit to my wife, Mrs. Hood, Dina Hood. And we bought new lab aprons this past year during COVID and they came in and we like, well, we have some extra time to do this. She had a great idea. Instead of having the students tie their aprons and they get in knots, we're gonna tie a little loop in one side, and we bought these cheap uh, clips or carabiners, however you say them, just online, Amazon. Like, we bought like 50 for like 15, 20, 30 dollars, whatever. And then when you put them on, you just clip them inside the loop. There's no tie, there's no knot. I, I don't, I say, I don't like when the knot goes in there. So I'd like not to have a knot, excuse my mask there. So you, you put it on and you bring it over and it's a simple clip. What we used to have to do is tie it. There, that's pretty simple. It doesn't fit extremely well, but it's much easier on the tying. And we used to have students have to go help someone else tie theirs. So that's a simple life hack on aprons. Use a care banner on one side and a knot on the other so it's close, so you can reach around, get that, and do it yourself very easily without having a knot. Okay, hope that helps everyone. And it's a cheap fix, and we always love cheap in our, in our house, in our uh, li living area, so I'll probably edit this video a little bit better, but that's how you make a lab apron, make it knotless, make it not have a knot. Also, um, in addition to the carabiner clips, you can see how we color coded these for the small, the hobbit size, and then regular person size medium, and then large Sasquatch size. So we have the small, medium, and large color coded with a piece of colorful tape or duct tape. Our family really likes to decorate. We have two daughters and they have markers and tapes, different kinds of tapes. So this was a good use for that. And um, this is another life hack with the apron to not only have the carabiners and the loops, there's the loop and there's the carabiner and then also the color coded neck, a little piece of tape on there. Hope that's, hope that's helpful. And maybe if you had some, it takes a little bit of time, took about 20, 30 minutes for it to do that. What I'm about to do right now is we're gonna talk about the life hack with um, Kleenex boxes. And I'm going to video a lab for my Chem 1s and AP Chems about the hydration number for copper 2 sulfate, cupric sulfate. 